Hi, I'm Fryn, I'm here with Del, and we are on the Meldon Viaduct on the Granite Way on Dartmoor. And you are watching Mended Cycling Vlogs. So, good morning, welcome back to another video. We're away again today, we're away in Porlock. We're going to start by going up the monstrous road climb of Porlock, although some of them are going to go up the toll road. Um, we're going to take in all the official climbs of Exmoor. So we've got Canterbury Hill, Exmoor Forest, uh, and a load of others. Um, it's about 106 kilometres. Kamut says two and a half thousand metres of climbing, so we know it's going to be over 3,000 metres because it's always way out. There are seven of us. Uh, we've got Ian, Dell, Pete, Justin, Dean, and Steve. So there's a few of us about. It's going to be a hot one as well. On top of all that, I've just had a week's holiday in Dartmoor and I decided to do some running like an idiot. And my knees have been playing up since. So who knows how far I'll get today. I'm jacked up on painkillers. They're still a little bit painful. <laughs> um, going up Porlock's probably not the best thing for them, but we will try. Um, can tick off a few more official climbs. I'm already shaking. I don't know if you can see from the camera because I am that nervous about this first climb. Yeah, let's get it done. Good morning all. Hello. Are you all excited for this? Who's, who's doing the main road? Who's doing the toll road? Well, toll road is way prettier, so I think we'd all do the toll road. Oh, I, and the main road is not a deal. You, you need to do the main road, don't you, Dan? I need to do the main road, unfortunately. Main road. Oh. So me and, it's just me and Justin at the main road. Yeah. So we'll, we we'll meet you at the top. <laughs> hey, marginal gains, quick wee before we got the hill. Oh man, that was a hard climb. Really hard. James Lowsley Williams, so much kudos if you did that umpteen times for your trenching. Oh dear me. You like that, Just? Oh, it's steep. And it went on, it went on. on and on. I, I was expecting to stop at the cattle grid. It, it said <laughs> two kilometres from that point and then it kicked up again. Oh. It was an average of 9% from there. Yeah, I can't believe we beat the um, toll roaders up though, because that's the easier way up. If it, it is a bit longer. K1 points! <laughs> that was beautiful. That's a beautiful climb, that one. Yeah, I definitely made the right choice. No, you've got to go back and do that one though. Yeah. One day. Did, did they not tell you if you come up this one, you've got to go back down and come no. back up the other one? No. You look knackered enough coming up the toll road. Oh, it's lovely. We were able to have a chat. <laughs> I didn't have any breath to chat, to be honest. No, I could imagine. There's something else that main road. It's yeah. just like in the trees, switchbacks, sweeping, no oh. cars. Oh, oh stunning. Oh. Yeah. You it? But we, no. we saved a pound coming up that way. <laughs> Was it worth it? No. I keep telling myself, but I don't want to let you know. Is this what we become? Strangers on the run. Did you like that, Del? Yeah. Find a good tune. Funnily enough. <laughs> <laughs> like, oh, at least you didn't have to go up it. I couldn't even look at the guy who said hi. <laughs> <laughs> Right, we should come off the main road, gone down a horrendous, <laughs> horrendously steep downhill, down some lanes. We're now ascending again towards Linton, and then I think we've got Exmoor Forest, which is another official climb. I think it's number six. So uh, goes up there somewhere. But it's stunning round here. Exmoor is beautiful. I'll show you nothing but love 
That was an awesome descent, wasn't it? All of the views. Fast. <laughs> Del squealing. <laughs> Had everything. That's quite a blast. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm still quite wary. I've still got a hole in my tyre. They really let it go. Yeah. <laughs> but we're going that way. We're going up Exmoor Forest. Right, so Dean assures me that this climb is steady and pretty and beautiful and not at all steep. So we're going to enjoy a little plod up this one. Let's see if we can find some uh, cafe somewhere on the top of Exmoor. Yeah, again, Dale, we've picked one of the hottest days of the year. It's about probably the longest climb we've ever ridden in the UK. Yeah, I think so. Nine kilometers. Nine kilometers. So it's nine nice in the trees. It's and beautiful though. It's just awful. All <laughs> it is. <laughs> Where are you off? <laughs> Don't crash on camera. So is this the actual top of the official climb, Dean? <laughs> and come back up. I would say, if this is downhill, I'd say the climb finishes back there. That was a long one. Yeah, it's long, flat. long and hot. Yeah. yeah. Smiling, look at that. <laughs> <laughs> We've just been enjoying the views. Talking They're just the sheep. incredible. Talking to the sheep. Talking to the sheep. Talking to the sheep. Get off the road. Welsh, it was like being at home. Now these are English sheep. What they do? Are they English sheep? They're English sheep, yeah. So two climbs in. Update on the knees, they're okay. My hamstrings though are a little bit tight, which uh, probably is because I haven't been on the bike for two weeks, but there we go. Uh, if I get around today, it'd be a miracle, but I'm gonna try my best. Okay, so we got to the top of Exmoor Forest, it was a long way. Uh, we had a very fast, short downhill and we were going back up again. I think we're up and down all day, I don't think there's any flat, uh, apart from flat white. Have yeah, we seen a cafe? We're in the middle of nowhere really, aren't we? <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> that wasn't an official climb, was it Dean? that was quite a nice one coming up there Lovely. yeah transition. that was a transition, a transition. it was <laughs> <laughs> this is downhill <laughs> Guess where we're going? <laughs> have a guess. Just have a guess. No more words today. Already. <laughs> um, I don't know what we're doing, but there is a 33% sign over there. <laughs> and it looks like that's where we go. Uh, thanks, Simon Warren. Uh, Grass Park Hill. Is that the one? Is it? That's the official climb. It's the unsuitable for him. Oh, we're doing that as well. Yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah. It's that one. Um, we don't have to, we can go at the main. What? What? 33%? <laughs> yeah. I like to not look. <laughs> <laughs> yes. In comparison to one of our <laughs> new hills. Oh my god. So, uh, saw pit. So the same? Yeah. <laughs> we, um... See, which, which idiot put that on the route when he's got dodgy knees? Yeah. God, what's wrong with you? I don't know. I might have to get an e-bike. <laughs> or something. Right, so next on the menu. Is Grass Park Hill. You in the right gear now? Nearly. I'm already in the bottom gear. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, that's the only one you need. Like she did want to come honest. We didn't force her at all. Yeah, right before the uh, 
really, really stupidly steep bend. I had a big crash and then I looked around. I could just see him in the hedge. I hope he's okay. Yeah, Pete's fallen off back there on uh, what was, what I thought Paul was going to be the worst climb of the day. That one was silly. Here he is. You hero. Yeah, point nine. I went into the, uh, I got a zigzag in. <laughs> went into the hedge. It was zigzag, but I couldn't run a bit too sharp on myself. Oh, oh fuck. I went to unclip. I clipped the ref oh, out, no. which is the wrong one, but I couldn't clip the right one. Yeah. So I went over. But, but bloke come running out to see if I was alright. Not on that bend. Oh, you got, oh no, you haven't got water. I got only the best. Very devil's spring, what is beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> so that's that's what you need justin you gotta go back down there and fall off oh. <laughs> every cloud every cloud yeah, exactly. every cloud so there we have it that one is grass park hill from brayford through the village of charles um, i can thoroughly recommend not doing that one and avoiding it at all costs um unless you want to fall off and get given some spring water by a stranger <laughs> Is that good, Steve? Yeah, it is good, but nobody else has anyone. They've all decided to go to the pub. Oh, yeah, well, no. <laughs> oh, yeah, the pub now, now they've seen you, look. Yeah, although there was uh, ice cream over the road, uh, they did spot that we just cycled past a pub, so there's actually a pub garden. So we're going to have a stop, a bit of refreshments. Probably uh, better now than a bit later, because we've got to go down a hill and we've still got three more climbs to do. It was fine, yeah, kind it was of. All right. Well, it, it was painful, but... It's just the two corners, because you see it in there. Yeah, and, and the weaving. And, and the big bang that was a bit oh, nerving. That was, was really that distracting, And I thought, actually. oh, I've got an excuse to stop now, and then nobody else stopped. I thought, oh. um, uh, Pete no, fell off. He, he was weaving. You not hear Pete fell off? Oh. <laughs> he, was, he was weaving, and then he overwoke. 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 <laughs> he overweaved. He overweaved and went into the hedge. <laughs> I shouldn't tell the story. And everybody I? just carried on. Yeah. Well, the thing is, there were so many decisions to make. Stop, never start again. So you hadn't spent ages on Vela Viewer looking through the grass park hill. But it turns out not in quite enough detail to pick up the 33% hill that snuck in there. I didn't even notice 33%. I, I just connected all the official claims together. What are we talking about? What are you doing, what woman? What the hell? Apparently, she I'm says she's it. really dirty. <laughs> <laughs> Take from that what you will. Ever... You boys know we've got um, three big climbs left, don't you? <laughs> <laughs> That's why we're on the prawns. <laughs> I might, might actually have a chance of keeping up with you on the next two. So we're, we're being sensible just with some little chips. You see the size of his burger and chips. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> I was going to pour some of that. I thought that was cooking. <laughs> you could try. Oh my God. Yeah. All that time wasting. And then some electrolyte ready. ketchup, that one is. <laughs> right, so we're ready to go again. It's been a very long stop. It's been over an hour. Uh, it's come a long time to serve some chips. <laughs> we're now going to descend down into, I think it's Bratton Fleming. And anyway, we're descending down and then we've got two climbs either side of the valley and then uh, Countersbury Hill. <laughs> Perhaps there was four climbs left. Oh, this road is amazing. This is Hedden Valley, it's a National Trust Road. We've got a stream going to our left. We've gone uphill again. <laughs> what a lovely road. In the trees, windy, beautiful. Actually, Dean's just caught up to me and says this is the actual climb. This is Trent to show, which doesn't surprise me, it is stunning. Another beautiful climb. But he says the other one's harder. This is the one to enjoy. <laughs> I'm not sure the next one's going to be. The next one's got some. They've got a twenty percent sign at the bottom. Oh, that climb went on for absolutely ever. I had a little warning. 
telling me there was 250 meters to go, but that was just to the junction. Then come around the corner and see the climb disappear up the hill there. But lovely views, the seaside, seaside, the sea. <laughs> and uh, yeah, just <laughs> speechless, absolutely speechless. This is lovely. It's hot up here, isn't it? Ridiculous. Can you not speak? Here's the first. <laughs> you didn't appreciate the views, Pete. You're quite a sadistic young gentleman, aren't you? <laughs> we love you. Well, they, they talk about the hardest 100k, and I think there are nearly 3,000 metres in 105 kilometres, so it's not not quite strictly to the rules because we don't start and finish um, an entire loop, and we've gone up a couple of climbs because we've got to go back down this one now to go up another beast of a climb, which is another official climb. Well, it seems ironic that Mendip Cycling Club that live in the Mendips have to come to Exmoor to get their yeah. climbing training. <laughs> this is true. Is, is the next climb the same as that climb? No, Dean said this was the easier of the two climbs. Is that true? <laughs> <laughs> what's, what's that face, Dean? Probably best we don't think about it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> It's definitely that one. The one that goes just straight up there. Yeah, it looks like a steep start to this one, but we're down the bottom again, and now we're up, up the other one. I have no idea what this one was called. I can't remember. There were loads of them. You not ready? You gonna go around and do another lap? Yeah, the 25% uh, sign there says it all. Yeah. The fact Steve's just pausing. <laughs> Go on, Dal. Ah, oh, crap. <laughs> I bloody need it. No, I'm not going to say anything now. <laughs> well, you nearly fell off then. Well, I did because I was breathing behind you. I was too close. So. <laughs> That's uh, two today. I hope it's not three. I caught it though. I visited the hedge. <laughs> made friends with the hedge. How far is it? Oh, it's, I think it's quite a long one. But it's the way home, so... But hang on, 25% all the way? I have no idea. I don't look at these things, I just make a route. I'm going to walk up to the corner. <laughs> uh, so, knee update. This, uh, this climb was too much for my knee. That was quite painful. So I've taken the walk of shame, but uh, Dale and Pete are back there as well, doing the walk of shame. Uh, Dale nearly crashed on this one, so she's a little bit skeptical about getting back on the bike. Which I don't blame her, it is ridiculous. I think my back just walking up it, and I'm limping. Uh, where's the top? It's also not showing any signs of relenting, I mean it just goes on up. I think Dean said this was comparable to Draycott Steep, and I don't think he's too far wrong. As it stands at the moment, we've done 75 kilometres and 2,000 metres of climbing on dodgy knees. So I'll tell you that, that it took this long to beat me. But six blocks more, and I didn't even think I could come. Uh, <laughs> onwards and definitely upwards. You all make it up. We, we rode up. It's a bit slippery on the wet surface, but it's all right. Oh, massive kudos. That was just hurting my knee right from the very bottom. Once, um, once I stopped for Dell, I, I couldn't get going again. I did, had a few, few little rides on the flat bits, but the, that was stupid. Oh, this is Catsbury Hill. Uh, I've struggled to film anything on here. I'm literally on empty. They've all left me behind. Uh, won't claim too many, I think. Yeah, that's me done. I've finished. My knee's gone. 
my ribs are hurting, my back's hurting, I just have nothing left. I don't even know how far the top is. It's a bloody long walk for a game to experience. Don't try cycling stupid distances with massive amount of climbing with a dodgy knee. dead. I was looking forward to that poor locked tour road for such a long way and every time I went up a ramp I thought it's got to be downhill after that. No, it was another uphill. That road from Countess Bree to Porlock goes on forever. I'm uh, glad I'm not driving back. Um, I'm going to collapse in a heap. Uh, if you want to do the sadistic route the link to my Strava is in the description. Why I have no idea, hardest 100k is in here somewhere, because that's killed me. Um, don't forget to like, comment and subscribe and we'll see you in the next video. You <laughs> dead as well? Why? Dead? I'm not completely dead, but it was a hard day out, wasn't it? It was a hard day out, it was yeah, hot, with the heat hot. And health, a lot of climbing. I reckon there was probably one or two, two climbs, too many almost, <laughs> with, the, with the heat. I think. And, and probably about 50k too much. <laughs> <laughs> Won't be you enjoyed it, you just. Oh, thanks for the route, Darren. He's fresh as a daisy. For years and years, I've been thinking about doing Pollock Road, Pollock Hill, and it's the third, it's only the third hardest hill we've done today. <laughs> <laughs> that sums it up, doesn't it? Hey, anybody want to buy a bike anyway? <laughs> Take over a YouTube channel? I think I'm done. <laughs>